What's going on, everybody? Welcome back. Let's see if we can do a stipulation draft. What are we opening here? What are we opening that we can stipulate on? What's happening right now? Okay. Unforgiven wants sneak attack through the Reacher or Eureka. Unless I see those cards, I'm, it's harder to it's hard to draft against those. I like Super Fritz to take all the counter spells, and I like Kerwit draw all the cards. Which leaves me with preordain or days. I think I'm going to start with a preordain. <sighs> Sheldock Isle. That kind of draws all the cards, right? <laughs> Alesh Norn, Progenitus, Recurring Nightmare is pretty sweet. I'll take a second pick Shelly. I think that's fine. Uh, Gush does draw all the cards. I don't love Gush, though. It's pretty bad. What if we take Dark Confidant and we just build, like, a Dark Confidant deck? Hey, Frank, last round opponent. I'm almost sorry. The first mulligan always had the low. Yeah, it sure did. It sure did. Yeah, I mean, I mean, like, it, the, the second two games just weren't good for me. I mean, no offense to you, of course. I'm not, I, I have, I've, you know, you, you drew it, you drew it. It's not your fault. You know, but, like, I didn't get to play magic. I played a land and then two lands, and that was it. <laughs> so I was like, I'm going to take Dark Confidant over. Ah, fuck. Underground Sea is good, though. Dark Confidant might come back. Let's 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 hedge on Dark Confidant coming back. Let's take Dark Slick Shores as well. A Bob is kind of like drawing cards, which is why I'm hoping that dude comes back. Let's Thank take a you. Spell Pierce. I think Spell Pierce is probably stronger than Shriek Maw. But Worn Power Stone. <laughs> Brett with the gifted sub. Thank you, buddy. Appreciate it. It's just frustrating. Like, most of the time, like... I don't know. It's 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 unfortunate getting Underground Sea and Dark Slick Shores and then wanting to take, like, Inferno Titan. I guess Baral is fine, especially for trying to draw cards. I don't know what this deck is doing right now, but let's take Torrential Gear Hulk through the breach, though. But then again, we also have Dark Slick and Underground. But through the breach, <sighs> see, this is this is why stipulations can be hard because, like, if I have a stipulation where it's like take through the breach, Sting Attack, or Eureka, and then I finally see those cards when I'm not super into the first step, which is like probably draw the cards, it's really hard. Yeah, I get that those weren't the best games, but you know those are pretty fun though. Uh, fun for you, perhaps. Yes. In the, in the fun equity category, you definitely had most of it. In the four seconds those games lasted. I'm going to take Phantasmal Image. I mean, these are all very good blue cards so far, so I'm actually pretty okay with this. Have you ever sat in a steel case gesture? No, I actually, I didn't even, I've never even seen the, uh, I assume it's a chair. Mono cheaty color then? What does that even mean? I am a Herman. I yeah, mine's. Uh, I have a Herman Miller Aaron, which is literally one of the best in one of the best investments I've I've possibly made for working from home ness. If you guys work from home and spend any anywhere anywhere north of six hours a day in a chair, I would definitely recommend getting a nice chair. Are we mono cheaty? Is blue the cheaty color? I expected black to be more of the cheaty color because it always it's put things in, it puts things into play. Uh... I wanted to pick one up, but keep spending it on other <laughs> frivolous things. Brett, I can't even imagine what you might spend your money on. I think Brett's I think think Brett's two main sources of of expenses are uh, subs for this channel and. 
uh, magic cards. Those would be my guesses. I think we just take bullets to Citadel. Like, we could actually have Tinker here. Forge Master. I don't know what's going on with this deck right now. I think the white cards have been very, very good, and I'm I'm, har I'm holding too hard to Dark Slick and Underground. I'm taking a Leshnorn. See, this is pretty, <laughs> you're, you're pretty close. One Magic Cards, two Woodworking stuff. Brett, dude, I'm, so, I'm really trying to get into Woodworking. Are you... Brett, are you into woodworking? Because that would be super cool to chat with you about it sometime. Ooh, Tezzeret, though. We have Bolas and Citadel. Okay, see, now we're on 50-50 here. Yeah, I literally just made an Evernote yesterday about some woodworking stuff. I'm looking for, like... I'm looking for a saw of some sort, and I'm trying to figure out the differences um, for me personally between like a circular saw like a a job site saw or like a table saw like a and and i've i, I like watch tons of like woodworking videos on youtube and stuff i'm it's really something i want to get into it is a very there's a very high barrier of entry though in the sense that like whenever you start a project you're like oh, let me get this one saw and i'll just work on this project but then you're like you'll, you'll probably need like 12 other tools sometimes they're cheap sometimes they're more expensive to do this one thing so you should invest in one of those two people on each end saws. Thank you. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, you're right. Totally. We should totally invest in that. Oh, the Cyclismo. Matt, what's up, my dude? Good seeing you, buddy. Welcome back. Appreciate the resub. It's true. You don't need them, but you want them, right? And they, they, the thing is, they make your they make your job easier. It's weird that you're talking about woodworking now because I follow a YouTuber called Peter Brown who's a woodworker and I always think he looks like you but a little off somehow. Hold on. I'm going to... One of my favorite... I'm going to link you guys to one of my absolute favorite woodwork woodworking channels. This is a guy called Chris Salamone. He, he's, uh, he's a woodworker. Even if you don't give a shit about woodworking, his channel is still amazing. He's got a super relaxing voice. And his stuff is like super, super cool to just watch him make. Uh, he he runs a is he runs a site called Four Eyes, Four Eyes Woodworking and Design. I was definitely tempted to start a new YouTube channel and like vlog some woodworking stuff if I started. It would definitely be like beginner level stuff, and you guys could yeah, treachery is definitely an easy pick here. Okay, but see now we have some. <sighs> We could have had Through the Breach and Sneak Attack. I just want you guys to know right now. I hate it. Okay, hold on. Let me look up Peter Brown. This is... I'm, I'm going to feel weird if I don't look him up. Peter Brown Woodworking. Oh, I totally... I, I definitely see it. Hold on, hold on. Yeah, I can definitely see it. It's definitely... <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> this is disconcerting. Okay, but now we have to... Uh... Now we have to make some decisions. It might just be Metamorph here. I don't think we're a Kozilek deck yet. Let's take the Riftwing... Let's take Riftwing Cloud... Ah, let's take Metamorph. No, Riftwing Cloudscape. That was that was tough. It was a tough decision. I had no idea what I was doing. Uh, I could just take time warp. I like time warp a lot. Don't sort by rarity. Sort by converted mana cost. Move cloud skate. Wow, you're ridiculous. Move cloud. Oh my God, you're still doing it. You're still doing it. I'm literally individually clicking on a card, so they're not all highlighted, and it's still moving every card. It's unreal. We're not a Talarian Academy deck. I don't know what kind of deck we are. I just want to take this Ulamog, but this deck has no way to play that. We're also seeing, like, no no card drawing. 
This is like literally one of the other fucking mediocre blue black decks. God, one two is incoming. I know it. I feel so bad right now. I started. I tried the Kerwitz step where it's like draft all the card drawing. We have seen no, no card drawing whatsoever. We passed like one frantic search for like a good land. We definitely don't have to be black. Actually, that's f completely fair. I don't think sneak attack is coming back, and we haven't. We through the breach is already gone. <sighs> Copter's card draw, but we have four creatures. So, you know, one of them is a phantasmal image. One of them is a six drop. I think our odds of smuggler's copter... I think this is probably the creature with the most upside for us. And this guy's pretty good. Yep, we're just taking Scarab God here. Oh, again, we're not 100% black, but we'll see. Does Yorion do anything? It blinks Riftwing. It blinks Torrential Gear Hulk. I, I, Torrential Gear Hulk's also really meh. I, like, I don't even put him in my cube because it just doesn't hit enough things. I could see Shambling Vents because we do have a Leshnorn. And I could just see playing. But we just have also no ramp as well. So it's like... I think we're just taking Repeal here. <laughs> Show and tell. Let's take Bitter Blossom. Bitter Blossom actually could enable some things in pack three. On Burial Ice being Sorcery means Ulamog is not an option. I guess we can just take Masterminds. I don't love it, but... Ding, 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 ding. Just get anything? No. Agadim's Awakening could be fine. We have Phantasmal Image, Baral. We could hit, like, we have no four drops. Like, we literally go two drop, two drop, two drop, two drop, five, five, five. I don't know what's going on with this deck. <laughs> four twos, four fives. Oh, boy. We really need to, really need to get there with pack three. The other Kozilek came back. So we would have Kozilek and Ulamog. Like, this was the pack that Sneak Attack was in, so somebody definitely took the Sneak Attack. I think it's Night's Whisper, but I also just want the Kozilek. What if we do take High Tide? We're very, very blue-centric right now. Let's take High Tide and see if that works with anything. Sure, living death. None of these picks are... Like, this is definitely like a 14 island deck right now. <laughs> oh, check your Discord. Hold on. Shallow Grave? Also Lingering Souls. Shallow Grave seems pretty bad for us. Let's take Lingering Souls. Brett, is this stuff you made? Because this is friggin' awesome, dude. Love it. Up. Oh. Kind of wanted the shambling vent there, but that's okay, I guess. Okay, mana crypt. That's that's a thing. Brett, these are awesome, man. Also, I'm pretty sure I have that, a very similar Ryobi drill. Look, another mana crypt to never draw. I'll take it. Oh, boy. Jace the Mind Sculptor. Okay. Past in Flames. You're not here. Jace is good. Let's Jace. We really got to find some way to... Mana Drain. Okay. Pack three. First three picks have been bananas. Okay. Cryptic Command. We're doing it. The dream is alive. 
can you build me a wood car that I can use legally on the streets of Chicago? I don't see why not. Cryptic, Jace, Mana Drain, Mana Crypt. Okay, those are four solid picks. Maybe this is actually the uh, Super Fritz stipulation of counter all the things, take all the counter spells. I think the only counter spell we didn't take was a daze. Bribery! Oh, baby. Whew. I don't think we're Tezzeretting. Let's take Tezzeret out. Oh, now Torrential Gearhulk's much better with Cryptic Command and Mana Drain. Oh, wow, that guy turned on. Brad, I'm totally, we're totally going to have to chat about woodworking, man. Oh, man, that's awesome. I feel like our friendship just leveled up. Yeah, I could definitely see Mono Blue splashing these two. Dig Through Time seems fantastic here. It's also another hit for Torrential Gearhulk. I like Misty because it gets underground, but I think Dig Through Time is actually just way better for us. It has become my main outlet now that I haven't played Paper Magic in nine months. So I built my desk, and by built, I mean my desk is actually a, like, it's like a white maple butcher block. And I put the frame on it and I put casters on the frame and I finished the desk and I love it to death. It's, it's great, but it's not like I didn't like have to do much cutting or anything like that. Um, I used the whole saw to make holes for where the mics are. The mics are actually in the desk. Now they have a uh, little holes for the, so here, I'll just show you. I'll take a picture on my phone and then I'll put it on the screen. So it looks kind of like this. Where like I cut, there's, there, I made holes in them and then the mic stands are actually going into the holes. Because there's a little, there's a little grommet for them. So like it's, it's super rewarding though. Like when I made this desk and when it was done, I was like, oh my God, this looks great. Like I feel like I kind of built this myself. So Palancron is actually pretty interesting. We have High Tide. We could go Infant with the Palancron. I think it's actually just Brazen Borrower, though. Look at this. Just to be clear, we've seen Eureka, Sneak Attack, and Show and, and Through the Breach in this draft. Dude, the pride of having made stuff is super nice. Snapcaster Mage. I really like Karn here as a Planeswalker, but I'm just taking the Snapcaster. Yeah, we're doing three stips at once. We're doing the Unforgiven stip, the Kerwitz stip, and the Super Fritz stip. It's all happening. <laughs> it's all happening. Eh, let's take Lightning Bolt. I like to... I like to multitask. Alexa, stop. What did she hear? Did I turn any of your guys' on, too? Yeah, we literally could have. We could have taken Sneak Attack, and then the Kozilek would have came back. Thirst for Knowledge? Deal. This deck went from looking terrible to looking really sweet right now. I don't know what the, this Ulamog is doing, but maybe with High Tide? Hmm. Also, Riftwing keeps going to the 5 spot. We know better. I think we need like two, maybe three playables depending on what this Wilmog's doing. Yeah, I was thinking if we took Turnabout, it'd be great. We also have Sheldock Isle, don't forget. Like we could literally put it back on top with Jace. We're never doing this, right? We're never, I think we're still taking it. Because I don't think we're, I don't think we're wandering a few more. Wand That's a good one. Oh, that's a spicy meatball. Let's take Corpse Stance, actually. If somehow we can put Ulamog in the graveyard, it's a, it's a playable. Oh, man, that's a late Shark Typhoon that I'm super grateful for. I 
I mean, we could just play Dark Petition, to be fair. We could also just play 18 lands. Oh, we can actually play Mana Crypt and 17 lands. Yeah, that's correct. That's gotta be correct. My son and I finally finished the Spider-Man play. Oh, man, that's so awesome. Man, I'm so glad to hear it, buddy. I enjoyed the game a lot. I think it was fantastic. Palancron? Okay, we're just playing Palancron instead of Ulamog. But Palancron enables Ulamog. <sighs> yeah, look, at last pick was Seething Song, Desperate Ritual. Well, that's something. Okay. What's... 24 cards. So... This deck actually looks significantly better than when we started. Well, you can't make infinite storm with Mind's Desire. You can just make infinite mana. Right? <laughs> so... Oh, I see what you're saying. You keep playing this. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. I, I get what you're saying. We repeal Pal... Yeah, we just bounce Palancron, replay it for a million, and then we storm. I don't know if that's great for us, though, because we don't really have a payoff. And especially because a lot of our cards are counter spells. This deck looks surprisingly good. I'm tempted to take out Palancron or Ulamog. Yeah, just keep doing it, and they're like, all right, I guess you got it. Hold on, Katie's asking if the milk in the fridge is okay, and I'm like, it expired on the 9th. We just haven't thrown it out or checked it, so. Um... Yeah, I kind of like both of these, because they are kind of like, we have high tide... We have Mana Crypt. We gotta make one cut, though. Or we could play 16 lands, which I'm not a huge fan of. This is a big mana deck. Maybe we could take a Repeal? So, is it okay? I don't know. <clears throat> I'm gonna say three of these. Shut up and this take like my money. Relax, it's a mono blue book. Sammy, thank you, buddy. I appreciate you, my dude. That milk is probably now yogurt. It's le it's it's chunky lemon milk. Did someone unplug the interweb earlier? I mean maybe is this red bull expired two years ago kitty asking if the milk is bad yes yes it is <laughs> i'm actually gonna send that to her oh okay that's pretty funny um so we have what this is like five black sources totally fine and like uh one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen blue sources okay Let's do it. Oh god, what is this, Brett? Spoiled milk explosion. Alright, spoiled milk explosion in three, two... <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's incredible. Alright, spoiled milk explosion in three, two... That's <laughs> <laughs> uh, incredible. That's incredible. Actually, can I only pop this out if I can? Where's my picture in picture? All right, spoiled milk explosion. It's not letting me picture in picture. Dang it. Wait, hold on. Is this it? Mini player. Nope, that doesn't do it. All right, spoiled milk. Stop saying it. Stop saying it. Dang it, Firefox. Get your, get your act together. <laughs> Oh, 
We have the link. We can smell it from here. Yeah, but for those people watching on YouTube, they're not going to be able to click that link, so. <laughs> Katie's response was Red Bull is a poison that doesn't need an expiration. Milk is not. Okay. Well, I can't argue with that. I can argue with how it's taking another minute to find a match. I want to pause it. Okay. Oh boy, snap it off. Oh yeah. This is the this is the ticket. We're gonna keep any lands we see with this thing. I have a bottle of energy drink on my fridge that's about to have a birthday. <laughs> person who drank that red bull i respectfully disagree i think we're just keeping both of these i mean i, I we we can now cast cryptic command so Katie laughed at that. <clears throat> Let's go island and put this guy into the chamber. The suspension chamber like Goku. Katie said, those are my days of pounding Red Bulls and pulling all-nighters while studying the finals in vet school. I don't remember the taste. <laughs> Shut up and take my money. Oh, what's happening? This is not mono blue. I feel tricked by... <laughs> Sammy, it's still mono blue. It's just got two black cards in it. It's mono blue with a lowercase b next to it. Same thing. It's the same thing basically the same thing what a lovely dbz themed song actually it's the isn't it the hyperbaric chamber i don't think it's the hyperbolic chamber right that's a hyper that's hyperbolic what is this let's go look up dbz chamber i thought it was the hyper it's the hyper it is the hyperbolic i'm so stupid The hyperbaric chambers are the real thing, so you don't get the bends, right? <clears throat> oh, they got a mana drain. Well, isn't that, isn't that just special? Oof. Oof! We get to, res we get to sneak down a Jace? Oh, boy. Love it. Love it. Love it less. They exiled their mana drain and their force of will. Oh boy. So is that the worst blue card in their hand? <clears throat> That's interesting. Yeah, you don't want to go into the hyper barbaric chambers. Hyper gallic lime flamer. I don't think that's a real thing. I think I'm under the impression you guys might be making up names now.
All right, this guy's coming on down. Send him on down to Rat Train. Oh boy, just bounce your your Shelly boy. You're gonna tap it in response? Sure. All right, go to the draw step. Okay, you did nothing with it. Very good, very good. <clears throat> Seems wild. So this turn we get to cryptic command something, and then we get to Snapcaster cryptic command something. I'm no expert, but that seems very good. Mama's little baby loves cornbread, cornbread. Mama's little baby. Actually, shortening bread. Mama's little baby loves shortening. Shortening, shortening. Mama's little baby loves shortening bread. She doesn't love cornbread. I'm combining both beans and cornbread. With Mama's Little Baby Loves Shortening, Shortening. So, you gonna cycle or cast that Typhoon? Probably cycle. We could actually cycle it right now for a 3 3, block this guy, draw a card. I kinda like that. <clears throat> oh. Chicken in the Corn, also solid. Did they not do anything? Oh, this is great for us. This is the life. We're living the life. <clears throat> Do you think we just time warp here? I don't think so. Like, we have no incentive to do so. Like, we can wait for them to tap out. Yeah, cycle that miscalc. Mama's little baby loves chicken in the corn. Mama's little baby loves chicken in the cornbread. That's basically all three songs combined. Oh man, they're taking two. So we counter this, we time warp, and they're dead. Uh, counter target spell and draw a card. One, two, three, four. And we can play around Spell Pierce. Yeah, they're dead. All right. Wow, this was... Our deck is powerful. Our deck is a powerful wizard. I'm going to close my window, though, because I'm getting real cold. Hold on a second. I turned the camera off because I have to, like, crawl over the desk to do it, and it's not us. It's unsightly. <clears throat> I might even go grab a hoodie. I'm going to grab a hoodie, too. Hold on. Right. <laughs> Oof. This hand's actually fine. All right. Keep it. Bouncing the land's not relevant. I just want to draw more cards, buddy. Come on, buddy. <laughs> check please <laughs> oh boy um yeah we're just gonna play preordain now because I want to hit a, like a spell both of these are good again put on top put on top sure Baral next turn is great god you remember that time they exiled their mana drain to force of will that was pretty wild. So I don't really want to play Baral here because they could play a Johnny. Enter Arctic. <laughs> oh. Yeah, so when the when the sun was out, it was actually nice. It was like 45 and it wasn't too hot or it wasn't too cold. It was just perfect. I had my window cracked open a little bit and it was like crisp. But not freezing. And now it's like once the sun goes down, I'm like, 
Well, it's a little cold now. <clears throat> sure. Hmm. It's not great. Um, we could actually Snapcast or Preordain and have a blocker. But I kind of like Baral here because next turn it lets us Bribery. And we still get to keep up Spell Pierce and Brazen Bar or Bounce, so... Remember the perfect weather at night in October at BlizzCon? Was it real good? I forgot how our weather was at BlizzCon. It sounds like California in October would be really nice. I would be burning. What is Mark? What's your What's your temperature there? Oh, because we're because we're talking about uh, we're talking about different different temperature. Uh, what do you call it? Different units of measurement. <clears throat> Remember when a convention existed? Buddy, I don't know what you're talking about. It was Chef's Kiss. <laughs> I hope they play something stupid like a Johnny. Oh, God. Oh, God. Just leave me alone, please. Never do that. Wow, that was terrible. I will definitely loot here. I don't want to pitch Island because reasons. I'll just pitch Sheldock, actually. Like, next time we get to Time Warp or Bribery, that's pretty good. Sure. They tried to Armageddon us. That is just absolutely the worst. Mama's little baby loves a cornbread. I'm waiting for their life total to go to 18. Oh, it didn't. <clears throat> Skyclave. <laughs> this is not. This. What is this deck, man? Wild. All right, well, we're going to copy all of this. So you got Mana Crypt in here. Okay. Well, <clears throat> Skyclave steals their, their Azorius Signet, actually. Trinket Mage actually gets nothing for us. Spellseer gets Mana Drain, but I think we just want the Apparition here. <clears throat> Oh, we do have Crypt, don't we? I forgot we had Crypt. That might have been better. I totally just forgot we had Crypt in our deck. Like, that's totally normal. That's a totally normal human being thing to do. Professional Magic players should totally forget that they have Mana Crypt in their deck. This is why I don't top 8 Pro Tours anymore. Back in my day... <clears throat> do you remember this sweet magic video? I don't think I've ever seen this, but I will watch it. Also, Snapcaster into Bribery is also pretty sweet. Mm. In general, not in this particular match. <clears throat> well, Palancron's not going to do it. They have two cards in hand, huh? I mean, <clears throat> Snapcaster and Spell Pierce or Preordain is nice. We also get to keep up Brazen Bar and Shark Typhoon, which I think is actually just fine. <clears throat> I'm just going to pass here. Like, Shark Typhoon for two, if they end up getting rid of Skyclave Apparition, is pretty good. It'll take care of their Geist of Saint Draft once and for all. Huh. 
I think I'm actually going to Shark Typhoon here. <clears throat> it's not exciting, but I do want to hit lands, so. And we did. Bitter Blossom. I'm okay with the Bitter Blossom here. We can still keep up Snapcaster, Brazen Barrer, and Preordain. <clears throat> Okie dokie. Uh, yeah, this seems fine. Let's get in there for two. Remember that time they tried to ravage the war and we were like, nah, spell pierce, brah. Okie dokie. <clears throat> still still going well here. I mean, lands are still fine. One, two, three, four. They go one, two, three, four. They have enough mana for everything, so that's not great. Time Warp is four. Snapcaster plus, pre, plus Spell Pierce is three. So we're almost there. <clears throat> we're almost there. I mean, if they play anything we can bounce with Brazen Bar, we're definitely doing that. And then just playing it. What is even happening right now? Do they have, like, Wrathom Count in their deck? Caracas, Jace. They have an Ugin. Balance. Sure. I would love a hard counter at some point. Hmm. <clears throat> so... I did not see Cryptic Command in their deck. I do see Force of Will. One, two, three, four, five. And Mana Drain. Ugh. <clears throat> I'm definitely suspicious of a Mana Drain for sure. I mean, I kind of want to try my luck going one, two, three, four, keep up Snapcaster into Spell Pierce, but that only works. One, two, three, one, two, three. They have miscalculation as well. One, two, three, four. We go one, two, three. We're one shy of being able to also miss pay for the miscalculate. <sighs> I think we're actually just fine and we don't necessarily need to do anything. <clears throat> Tarifi, huh? Um, I think this is actually fine. I assume they're going to tuck something. Probably the shark. That doesn't seem great. I mean, if they tap out, we just go Palancron into Time Warp and probably kill them. Remember when this deck looked really bad? It's actually been very, very fun. I want them to draw a card and then Teferi is going to get tucked, or bounced rather. I don't want them to... Wait, that doesn't make any sense. <laughs> Ignore that whole line. Oh, we just win the game. Okay. Sounds good. It, I don't have to do any of these things that are in my hand, I guess. Oh, 
Uh, Mandarin was in their deck when we <clears throat> when we looked, but that was several turns ago as well. So definitely keeping this hand. A lot of expensive things, but Bitter Blossom and three lands. So. Oh, they went to six. If we can top deck a Mana Crypt in the first couple turns, that would be. Oh, good. Crystal Brand shouldered into the graveyard. How nice. Well, we do, we can Brazen Borrow or something. Let's take Spell Pierce. <laughs> it's not exciting, but it, it's it's one of the few cards that will interact with them. Okay, Night's Whisper is fine. So the question is, do we Bitter Blossom or do we just keep up Brazy Bee? I think we're Bitter Blossoming here. Necromancy, yep. <clears throat> so if it's shoulder it's rough because we lose our token. Mm. No, we don't. We actually get our token because ours goes on first. Theirs goes on second. Bristlebrand, sure. Yep, draw your seven million cards. <clears throat> draw seven more. No? Okay. So if they play it again, we just get to Jace, so. Living on a prayer, I'll take my hand. <clears throat> Makeshift manic. Oh, all right, sure. Shieldred. You got it. Now they're going to have to discard like 20 cards? Is shell docking a thing in the turtle world? I'm all for it, but I feel it needs to be reversed. <laughs> no, just, just no. Oh boy. <clears throat> okay, so yeah, all right. When a mommy turtle and a daddy turtle love each other very much. Oh, boy. Thank you. You think they got another reanimate card? I'm just going to have to keep dealing with these idiots. <clears throat> Music Manly, welcome back. I appreciate you. Thank you for the resub. 15 months? That seems low, man. I feel like it's been longer. Discard four cards. Kill my Jace. Cool. Cool, dude. Seems good. Well, we're playing this because we get to play Brazen Borrower and we get to keep up uh, Spell Pierce. They have seven cards in hand, huh? That's pretty good. Pretty, pretty, pretty good. <clears throat> you said the same thing in 14 months. Yeah, it still seems low. So it's true. It's all, it holds out. Yeah, I'll take two. I'm working on it. That's true, actually. 
that is a fair thing yeah that's fair you are literally actively working on it i've i see the results You got it. Don we now our gear peril? <laughs> Dig through time is a card on my graveyard. So we're going to force them to use Ancient Tomb, which means we get to uh, kill them. But we shall see. Oh, no. Yes? Yes. Excellent. Counter the truth time unless you pay two. You done messed up, A.A. Ron. You should just delve one more. Oh boy. Oh, biscuits. So we're hoping they don't have lightning bolt or burst lightning, I guess. They changed their mind. They said no. No, no. No, no. I have no cards in hand, so as long as you can deal with what's on board, you're good to go. Cube is faring okay. Oh, they're, they're, they're doing it. Okay. How's the shuffler faring? <laughs> I'm eating blueberries. <laughs> I love Kerwitz Ralph Wiggum-esque comments. I'm eating blueberries. My cat's breath smells like cat food. Do you have any thoughts on Showdown of the Scalds in Impossible Martyr Yorion deck? Um, I think I wrote about that card like last week. Yeah, now they're going to kill the Brazy Bee. I'm playing a, a mostly mono blue deck. Don't let me draw a counter spell, man. Don't do it, bro. Shut up and take my money. Oh, boy. Overkill stipulation mono green ramp. Kill with Crater Hoof. Always my favorite deck. Extra bonus points if you can finale for devastation on 10 to grab hoof. Okay, hold on. That sounds great. I'm in. Gimpy, I appreciate you. So the problem is if we go for their face and we lose, they get back Gristlebrand next turn. They, it did say paying costs, so we know they have something. So I think we're just attacking both at Liliana, one both at Liliana and one at their face here. So that way we're still putting them to two if they kill this, and we're still putting Liliana to one if they don't. So <clears throat> Yep, I had a feeling they had lightning bolt. It's very hard to win games where your opponents literally draw seven more than you from Gristlebrand. God, if we like, I don't know why they would let me draw a counter spell. If we draw a counter spell, we just kill them. Like, there's literally zero incentive to not just cast the lightning bolt when I'm tapped out. That's so. That's so bad. Like, okay, 
Extra bonus first, you can find your station. X equals 10 plus to grab daddy for maximum overkill. Gimpy, Merry Christmas, buddy. Thank you so much. Really appreciate it. You are awesome, dude. Awesome. Going right in the... Putting it in the queue. Gimpy, have I asked if the MN is from Minnesota? Also, don't worry about me being here. I mostly catch your... Sweet. Good to know. Good to know. I appreciate it. Gimpy, Minnesota. Everybody knows Gimpy. Is Gimpy a city? Or is that just the is that just the, the name? So we're taking six here. I think that's fine. I mean, if we draw like time warp, we just win, right? The Rakdos return really did a number on us here. Just the nickname I've had my whole life. When I was born, my parents were like this dude's gimpy. Are they just playing Grave Daddy? I mean, that's not great for us, but it doesn't change the course of our... Yeah, okay. And that was how we died. They just had it all. That's not going to do it. That would have been good. Okay, so... Leshnorn seems pretty sweet. Can we do that? Hmm. I don't think so. Bribery seems great here. So does Treachery. I feel like our deck is actually very good against them. We just didn't... We just didn't get it. It's real quiet in here. I think Katie let the dogs out. Ooh, let the dogs out. <laughs> <laughs> are, you, are you doing okay? Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, uh, yeah. This is a hand. This is a hand. We could use more, we could use more lands, but there's always time. We could also just play this into, well. Okay. Ulamog? Shark Typhoon. Actually, I kind of like Snapcaster better than Shark Typhoon because it uh, can hit Mana Drain. So. Hello, my dear. Hello. Wow, it's so loud. Are you coming and joining me? Yes, I'm going to stay here. Oh my god, things are happening. This is exciting. Okay, hold on, put all my drinks away. Get this out of here. <laughs> While he's scared of everything. Okay, get these things out of here. I like how you're letting me literally take everything off. You're like, all right, keep going. Take all the things off the chair. Yeah, it's your chair with your stuff. Okay, let's see. Ma'am? Okay. Hello, stream team. Well, hold on. Meme I got to unmute your mic. Okay, there you go. Hello, stream <laughs> meme team group. You guys, can you please tell Franklin that... Black Source. We should get McDonald's for dinner. Okay. And he should support this because it would make me so happy. She loves McDonald's. I love McDonald's. It's like like an unhealthy amount. Oh god, what is this? <laughs> oh boy. Well now we're probably just gonna attack. You girl. What? <laughs> oh, you can hear me in the background. Oh, okay. Um, so I can play Gear Hulk, but that's not super exciting. Get the dang McDonald's. Oh dear. I think we're just gonna do this guy. Bribery. Wait, does all of stream know about the milk and the Red Bull and the The Milk and the Red Bull? Mm. Yeah. They were the ones yeah. who, that was Kurt responding in chat. Oh. Um, let's just get rid of an artifact here. Gear Hulk is fine. And then we're just going to waste this mana, unfortunately. But we do have a bribery coming down. You like bribery, babe? I don't even know to like the bribery. What does that even mean? Not in real life. Oh, it's a little snake man. I got the yawns. Oh, no. Oh, no. Give this woman a greasy burger. Uh, we're just going to play this here. That's what Mark says. Who? Mark. Oh. 
I feel like McDonald's isn't super if greasy, right? If you don't, right? I will. <laughs> Am I gonna get you McDonald's? Yeah. Oh, good gravy. Good gravy. That's true music, manly. What is what's true? She liked bribery, but she liked McDonald's better. Hmm. Thank you. So if we attack so the problem with Doretti here is that if we get grave gravy boy or uh gristly bee, they Thank can just you. literally sack this to kill it. Nifty Chris with the five. five subs. High five. Oh, Jace the body sculptor Thank got a you. sub. Wow, he's lucky. He's got a nice body and. Well, you don't so. know how you don't know how successful he is though. Thank what if he's you. Jace? What if his name is Jace the body sculptor, but he's actually not great at it? He should get a new profession. What if it's just his name? What if he's not? Thank what you. if he's not even doing that for a living? He should get a new hobby. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, that's fair, I guess. Nifty crit. Oh, we just won the game. They're like, you know what? Forget it. I don't want to play anymore. They took their toys and they left. All right, so we're one one win away from being 2-0. The antibody, I can respect the hustle, but having worked at McDonald's and having to make new fries for that one B in the drive through line, and it takes seven minutes... It's just no oh because they make the fries fresh if you ask for no salt yeah because you immediately salt them when they come out of the fry interesting but also i have salt in my house so i would never ask for salt packets i'll just use the salt <laughs> i have in my home because it's like 30 cents for like a big thing of salt like this big probably like this i think we have one this big <laughs> sometimes katie uses it as a body pillow <laughs> so Fancy art, just because you had some yesterday. I mean, every day is a new day. Sometimes I get McDonald's twice in the same day. No, so. she's stopping this. It's not a thing she's going to keep doing. But I only have until the 31st, which means today our and maybe tomorrow. Our energy bill was 148 this month. Not bad. Is this thing that we bought doing anything? Because I don't think it's doing anything. You think 148 is high? My energy bill in Florida was like $300 someday. Brett, how much is someday? your someday? Someday, someday it was three. <laughs> someday. Ooh, which one? What should I put under the the shell doc? Um, it's kind cryptic. of cryptic, right? Yeah. Thank you. Um, Brett, what was what's your energy bill in Florida? What's it? Three eighty nine at peak of summer. Yeah, it's mine is very similar. Like, we oh would hit God, like three twenty, three three thirty. Some days, and we were just like, w w but why? Okay, so we have Phantasmal Image if they put something in the graveyard, and we also have Brazen Bar to bounce, and we also have Mana Drain to play Jace next turn. Guess what we also have? Tell me. Wowie. <laughs> Wowie. We don't, actually. You just He's right here. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. He wants to say hi. Oh. Matt with numbers. Thank you for the reset, buddy. Welcome back, my dude. <gasps> you want to say hi to the stream team, buddy? <gasps> Look at him. Oh, no, his head is underneath the... The, I so. Oh God! Hang on! Hang on! Hang on! Here. Okay. Now we can see. Here. I kind of just want to discard dig through time here. I'm not paying attention at all. I know it's okay. I'm just petting Wowie. Some good months where it rains a lot will be under. Yeah. Be, the problem is with Florida, you have to run your AC so regularly to keep up with the heat. Maybe we shouldn't move back there. <laughs> It, it'll be fine it sounds horrible it's not as bad as Molly it. didn't want to be seen he hit his face in my arm look at him oh my god he's he's too pure for this world okay you sit there I'll cuddle you don't get mad at Wally he didn't do anything wrong oh bribery again oh if we counted the crocs so we could have bribery this turn this hand is actually insane against them I know, I was, I was like, what are they going to do? It doesn't matter. Yeah, you got it. You can have your stupid prowly boy. Prowl away, prowler. Whatever this is, is not. You're just casting that as a man? Cast him as a man. <laughs> exactly. Um, I don't even care. I mean, I do because I want a bribery next turn. I think that's where the strategy lies.
Yeah, I don't really want to live in California. I do. Why? California is wonderful. Because it's expensive? Yeah, that's why. That's, that's the reason. I'm like, give me an expensive place to live. And housing costs a lot. And getting anywhere takes a long time. Do they take out all their big guys, you think? I don't know, but we about to find out. They did. They boarded into like a weird small deck. Um, Sure. This is really weird because I feel like we are not super threatened by whatever they're doing right now. And they have three cards. Oh, boy. I think we just take Rabble Master here. Or Solemn, actually. Solemn actually seems real good. Yeah, let's go with Solemn here. I would take the Solemn. I wanted you to work through it in your brain. <laughs> Thanks, babe. I appreciate your support. You're welcome. You ever search for a land, and then when he dies, you get a, you get a, you get whatever you want. You, well, you not not you get whatever you want. Yeah, she, you get whatever you want. You name it, it's yours. Sure. Oh, sorry, I punched the microphone. That's really rude. Wow, this is hilarious. What they boarded into? They took out their whole reanimate strategy. When it dies, you get McDonald's. <laughs> wow, did you know when Solomon Summer Larkham dies, you get McDonald's? That got my ears to perk up. Uh, Okay, so they're just playing this for no value? That's weird. Taking my dig through time. Sounds good. Did you guys miss Wally today? Because I did. I don't I don't really have to miss Wally because he... Oh, wow. Okay. Rub it in. <laughs> did, did I, though? Hit my baby boy. So if I... Fant no, I can't do that. Never mind. That's not going to work. What are you trying to do? What are you trying to do? You don't have to say it. What? You don't have to say it. <laughs> um, I was going to Phantasmal Image copy this and then see if I can get this, but it doesn't work because this is not a sorcery in the graveyard. It's a creature in the graveyard. It's a creature. It's true. If we Scarab God, they're just going to kill it, but that might be fine. They have one card in hand. Like, I feel like we just have to Scarab God here because they have no choice but to kill it with Duretti. I don't know if that's great, though. We can also Jace bounce the Dire Fleet. Attack Duretti. What's he do when he enters the battlefield? Uh, who? The Dire Fleet. Uh, he, you can cast an instant or sorcery card from your opponent's graveyard. And I wanted to cast this to destroy this, and then cast them as a creature. But battle display is only from your hand. It's like it's a creature in the graveyard, so it's not an instant or sorcery. I know, but you're saying you're going to bounce their dire fleet? I was, no, I was going to copy with Phantasmal Image. Oh. We could we could play Jace and bounce this so that I can attack the Duretti. But then when you replay it, then he gets to play Viber Bribery and take Actually, you know what I like? Let's Phantasmal Image the Solemn Simulacrum. You can do whatever you like. And then we can keep up Brazen Borrow to attack Duretti or to even block the the Una. Una's prowling. Una's, Una's prowling. <laughs> that's the, the, that's the, the Chicken Patty song. Chicken Patty chicken patty it's true it's classic in our house we sing it at least 25 times i sing it all the time you rarely sing it okay well that's because you're so addicted to it i can't give you too much of a good thing why not you'll die is that how it works <laughs> that's the only that way sounds works. terrible so the question is do we brazen borrower and block what if we brazen bar now or we can just brazen borrow attack already i think we're gonna do that i'll just take the, the three here Chicken patty. While he's asleep. Watson was very good today. Was he? So good. So proud of that boy. So good. He's making great strides. <laughs> At six years old. He's really okay. coming along. Okay. He's not perfect. But you always say he is. He's perfect in my eyes. Okay. <laughs> okay. One, two, four, five, six. This is seven mana. This is so much mana. Attack to ready. Attack to ready. I 
kind of like Jace bounce this. Because then they don't have a threat, and we can also Shark Typhoon for one if we really need a blocker. We can still hard cast Shark, Shark Typhoon. We also have a Cryptic Command under here, so I'm looking forward to the day. Okay, so they're sacrificing to kill my Brazy Bee. Sure. You got it. What's going on over here? Nothing? Okay. Making Just sure. Robin Wally's ear. Thinking Robin about Wally's what those three ear. cards in your opponent's hand might be. What could they be? About one's a mountain. One's a Colagon's command. That would be real good. He has it in his deck. Didn't you see it? Yeah, but they could have killed Jace and a Solemn if, if that's true. I don't know if they Maybe were. they're waiting. Well, that seems real greedy. Yeah. I actually kind of want a Shark Typhoon for one here. It gives us another play, but it also gives us a Flyer, so they either have to trade Una's Prowler. Or we can just bounce the Prowler again and kill Doretti, which I think is way more important. Chicken patty. Oh, they, we just win the game. Maybe they had They're like sharks, three mountains. Shark Typhoon? That's where I draw. For a 1-1 one, one Flyer, that's where I draw the line. I think they were just riding on that already. I feel like taking out their big strategy was pretty bad. Like, even if I have bribery, like, it's still five mana, and you have so many more ways to get, like, big creatures into play. You can exit out of that garbage deck. That's true. Like, I mean, they're, like, they traded, like, Gristlebrand and Shieldred and, like, all that for, like, a, for, like, a... For one card a in Monastery deck. Swift yeah. Spear and, like, a Dreadhorde art. I'm like, these, these cards are nowhere near as powerful. It's just sad. Frank and Katie, what are your favorite type of chips? One one, I quit. I don't know what your favorite type of chips are. Sour and cream and onion, I think. That's my favorite kind of Pringle. Oh, okay. Okay. I like a diverse chip portfolio. <laughs> I like anything with heavily cheesed. I like nacho cheese Doritos. I like cheddar and sour cream. He does like those. And like, I love it when I get to the bottom of the bag and there's all the cheesy ones. That's where I, that's where I live. That's where my, that's where my home, my home is. Chicken patty. Chicken um, patty. I like to buy those variety packs at the store of the mini bags. And then she I do like don't that. like to eat the ranch Cool Ranch Doritos cool ranch is out of a, there, but I like everything else. Cool Ranch is a subpar chip, I'm going to be honest with you. I like Cheetos, Fritos, and Doritos Manager. because they're all corn-based, so I can eat them without feeling bad. I'm going to be honest, I kind of like high-tiding and then playing Jace here and bouncing this. I think that's strong. You do you, boo-boo. Because now they have no pressure and we get to, you know, what do you call it? Time walk? No, not, t well, kind of, technically. Mm -hmm. High Tide is a weird name for a chip. Yeah, but you know what they say. Chip it up and chip it out. Yeah, we're definitely doing I this like again. I like sun chips. And now we get to play Riffling Cloudscape next turn and, and plus Jace or zero Jace. <sighs> Chicken patty. I like just plain ruffles. I like plain chicken patties. It's not true. I like... Do we make a tutu here, babe? I think so. You do you, honey. Okay, you're just... <laughs> <laughs> She's really here for the strategic advice. No, I'm here to talk about chips. Oh, also chips and salsa, just in general, is... Oh my god, I love the... What is that thing that I made us get from that place? Spinach darn jokes. <laughs> oh, yes, 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 yes. From yes. Applebee's. <laughs> so I'm gonna riffling cloud skate. If they have if they have mana tide, we're gonna get mana tide. That's it's it sucks, but we did not. Really we didn't, okay? <laughs> okay. You can't say we're definitely getting it and then <coughs> didn't, didn't get it. It's only because he F six through your turn. On accident. He doesn't know how to play Moto like me. <laughs> He's not good like me. So next time we get to just play Scarab God, that seems good. 
we have bounced their second turn play, their third turn play, and their fourth turn play. Pickle Pringles. I haven't tried those. Did Rhett and Link review those? No. Interesting. I thought they reviewed all the Pringle play, Pringle play bursts. No, I think they reviewed 16 Pringle flavors. That seems like a lot. Um, he likes the tomatillo salsa from Premium Kitchen, which is the no private selection. Private, private select. selection. Private. It's Are a, you it's, sure? Yes, I'm positive. It's okay. called yeah. That's the that's like the Kroger brand. That's like their that's chef's his, kiss brand. Yeah, he loves that one. He loves it. I don't like it, and I'm pretty easy to please when it comes to salsa. One, two, three, um, four, five. There are salsa flavored trip chips. That I, they sell them at work. I think they're called salsalitos. They're pretty good. So next time we can palancron untap, play Baral, play dig through time, and that seems juicy. Oh snap! Finally back from my last Hellcat, Hell call, Hell call that took over an hour. Oh, it's the deciders, Michael. Michael, I want McDonald's. Can okay. you make Franklin get me McDonald's? What is what makes one call take an hour? When they're really mean and they won't shut up, so you can't just fix your stupid problem. Actually, that wasn't my question. My question was, does it does it penalize you if one call takes an hour? They're going to play Council's Judgment. You ready? One. Two. Okay, Thalia. They're going to give their Brimaz Pro Blue. Okay. These aren't nearly as exciting as what I thought they were going to be. Yeah. Boar's Head, have you had the Salsalito turkey from I have Boar's not Head? because I never knew what the flavor of Salsalito was. So I. Didn't. What does that taste like? Should we get that? I'm going to look it up. I am a big fan of Bo They didn't attack. They didn't kill Jays? Salsalito? Is it Salsalito? Sal no, no, it's it Salsalito. Salsalito. Boar's Head Salsalito Turkey Breast is an enchantment of flavors coated with a spicy salsa of jalapeno peppers, onions, sun-dried tomatoes, and cilantro. Each slice delivers Southwest flavor. That sounds pretty Hell good. Hell yeah. She likes it. Sounds banging. Ooh, Super Fritz is going to live that nug life. <laughs> if you keep talking about it, Kurt's probably just going to buy you nugs, so... Well, I don't, but I don't want Nugs, Kerwit. No, he's, well, that's, okay, but I, okay. <sighs> so I'm at a point where I just kind of want to plus Jace because I think that will save Jace. And I think we are, we are fine with what we have in our hand right now. Yeah, save him. Show me what you've got. Ha ha, ha ha, ha ha. Uh, no, you can have that. That's not impressive. Palancron, oh Palancron, hear my cries, Palancron, West Virginia, <laughs> Mount Mama. That was an amazing Palancron song. Thank you. I wrote it. I knew you did. I was like, there's no way anyone else would have written this. <laughs> Look at what Kermit said. Kermit knows you like cheeseburgers and filet of fish I thought you were about to sing Show Me That Smile again. Show me that smile. I don't think I've ever heard the intro song to that. Are you serious? Yes. That's a classic. So we actually, this is, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, plus the one from Thalia. This costs nine. We are a little a ways. But you could delve. This guy, huh? Did you take that into account? Never thought about it. Oh. So now they kill Jace, which is weird because they had a chance last time. Look at Wally Pop. Okay. He's just a... He's just a long boy. Uh, let's go block your
If only had a creature in the graveyard. That would be great. Okay, the Full House theme song is definitely a banger. Whatever happened to predictability? The Milkman, man, the, the paper, paper boy. boy. Talk Eating about on Michael TV. B. Oh, okay. You missed your old familiar, familiar friends. So I think we can actually, we can dig through time now because we have eight Waiting and Thalia and Baral cancel each other out. So I think we're digging. Oh, hey, hold on to. Wally, should we paint your toenails? When you're lost about the Ulamog. Ooh. Six, seven, eight, nine, Ulamog. ten. We can actually take Mana Crypt and Ulamog, and we're literally one away from casting it. I think we're definitely doing that. Look at all those lands. Bye bye. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> bye bye. So you later, lands. I don't have any zombies, unfortunately. Does that do anything? Six, seven. Ooh, I like that guy. Eight, nine, ten. We can actually snapcast or dig through time. That's pretty good. Oh, we can't because of the stupid Thalia. Dang it. I was like, I don't feel like you counted this right. No, it's still correct, but I, I just, okay, I'm one off because of Thalia. I'm one off. Okay? Just, just relax. Counting is important, dear. Whatever. I've never counted a day in my life. Really? Mm -mm. Well, that's wild. When I give drugs to patients, I just give them a random I <laughs> just give them a handful. <laughs> there you go. Oh, you're going to... Wait, can I just bounce this? <gasps> Wally, don't bang your little your little skull. My little baby boy. Well, that, was, that was a weird choice, but all right. <gasps> Show me oh, that no. smile again. So I'm going to play this now because if we if we do hit a land, we can play Ulamog. And if we if we hit a land next turn and don't play this, then we're still gonna have to pay one for Thalia. So one, two, three, four, five. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Why? I think your monitors are here. Do you think I have to talk to him? You might have to sign for them. Uh, I would not risk them uh, not them leave. Okay, please, please. Okay. I'm really gonna have to. I hate talking to people. Okay. Can you fix that curtain? So, no. thanks. Okay, it doesn't change the doesn't change the desire though, unfortunately. Interesting. Just these two, huh? Brimaz is big. This is great because now we can get back our Riffling Cloudskate. So, and then we can bounce their Mother of Runes. Like that a lot. They're going to wipe the board. Wrath of God. Are they going to Armageddon? That would be terrible. Not for us per se, but you know, for them. Was it your monitors? Yeah. Did you have to sign? No. Okay, they good. They were already gone, too. They were real quick. They were like, peace out. And then there was something. I'm on a bottom thirst. Amazon about animals? Something from Amazon about animals. I don't remember ordering anything about animals. Oh, cryptic command? Sure. It's chilly outside. Is this blue or just black? It's just black, right? So, <gasps> yeah, babe. Cat cube! She real excited. Um, yeah, we're just tagging with this guy. And then we'll play a palancron. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Untap seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Keep up cryptic command. And Snapcaster dig through time. Don't open any packages from the Congo in regards to animals. What does that even mean? Oh god, I'm sorry. Punch the microphone again. 
Uh, I think this is fine. Oh, 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 sorry. You know what? Sorry. You're being real sassy right now. Yeah, we're countering that. You we're... haven't even seen my sass yet. I definitely have. I don't know not if you... Not today. Okay. Uh, we're actually not going to return the mother because then they just replay it. Counter-strike spell draw a card. Cat cube was in reference to a cube that I bought for Little Man to go in my Calyx downstairs so underneath no. my computer so that he can snuggle. Oh my god, we can actually replay Snapcaster and... Do it again? Yeah. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 12, 13, 14, 15, 15. Okay, we're just going to kill them here. We're just going to snap cryptic. Snap cryptic. Snap cryptic. This is the song of Are her people. Are you going to draw a card too? I am going to draw a card, yeah. Yeah, you should. Okay. Woo! Tap all creatures, draw a card. One. <laughs> that was a weird noise. Hi, Wally. And we won. Winning the game is cool. Don't waste another minute not winning the game. I'll bring Repeal in. Can we bring a Lesh Norn in? No, probably not. We can take out the Ulamog. He's kind of, he's a little slow. <laughs> the best is ready to begin. We should probably do a grocery order soon. I already, I started a list already. <sighs> Did you start it in the King Supers cart? No. Okay. Because I don't know how long those last. Okay. Like, I don't know if it's going to empty after like yeah. five days or whatever. Or if like something goes out of stock between when I put it in and when we check again, I don't notice, you know? Hmm. Oh, they went to six. They're basically dead. Show block. Yeah, we're definitely putting the Jace under there. You don't want to put Spell Pierce? <laughs> Did you? Would you have put Spell Pierce? No. Hold on, let's just... <gasps> Are you... Hello? I feel like you're being aggressive right now. What is this? <gasps> is this a volumizer? A volumizer? How do you work it? Don't mess with it. Oh my god, you literally just raised the game. Just you have to just leave it alone, please. I love you, but there's like... <laughs> it's very sensitive and like there's... I, I have it set to the right levels, so there's no reason for it to us to change it to the wrong levels. I'm so sorry. Okay, I understand. It's okay, you're not in trouble. I feel like I'm in trouble. You are. I'm very angry. Papa's just, real mad. It looked at the... It just looks so... Yes. Pokeable. Pokeable. <laughs> it's, it's also one of your favorite entrees. Mm -hmm. so. And it can never be set back once motions are made. That's true. Once you put the once you put the plan in motion to raise the raise the game. We like to party. We like we like to party. Do you really? Oh my god, this is so many one ones. Holy crap. Only if partying involves going to bed at 9 p.m. You do love to do that. Hmm. Well, I think we're going to shark typhoon for two. And really hope they don't play like Honor of the Pure. God, if, I, if we were able to just play Leshnorn. Maybe we just take out all the black swords and play Leshnorn? That seems. We can also just play Living Death, which is probably fine most of the time. And does a great... Lingering Souls is such a good card. It's true. I don't think that, I don't know if they have a black to flash it back, though. Oh, yes, they do. We saw it. I was like, I'm pretty sure they already did, didn't they? No, it's still in the graveyard. Oh, they the played graveyard. Spectral Procession. Oh, obviously. Everybody knows that. <laughs> <laughs> don't be a nerd. Don't be a nerd. Yeah. Hmm. Is that what you want? What? Exactly. I'm a nerd and I'm proud. You gonna protect this? Oh, they didn't. Hmm. That's pretty good. I like this. 
Okay. And I like that this face matches this face. <laughs> That's his mask. I like it. I like it. Don't waste another minute <coughs> crying. Do, 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 do. Might as well bounce. Might as well do it now. Hi, relaxing Sam. I had such a merry Christmas, except I burnt our ham <laughs> again. <laughs> She's a real ham burner. I'm not. I'm never making ham again. But besides that, it was very. I'm merry. never making ham again. The ways those fuck pots that I'm cooking. Do you think Lingering Souls would warp Standard today like it did back? Um, I don't know anything about Standard today. So. Yeah, it really depends on what's available. So it's hard to say, you know. I would hope so, just because I like it a lot. I hope that you had a good Christmas, everyone in chat, or holiday season. When are my shoes supposed to get here? I don't know. They made it to StockX today, though. So, order arrived at StockX. So they're gonna verify them. Look how cute they are. And they're gonna send them over. Can you show stream the shoes that I got? Oh, he getting big mad. He don't want to. He don't want to show no, you. No, because it's a whole. It's just a whole to do. It's no big deal. I know, but it's important. <laughs> so you know, it doesn't even save it as an image. So I have to go in here, and I can't even save it. Hold on. Uh, nope, can't use that. Screen. Okay, download that. <laughs> These are the Boba Fett shoes that Katie Katie's picking up. They're so cute. They got that little pouch from my goodies. Pouch? You ain't gonna put no goodies in there. You don't know what I'm gonna put in my little pouch. I know. I'm familiar with your one your little your little shoe habits. So they have 28, we have 25. We're quite far from this Jay Serino. Thank you, Michael. They have two cards, which seems good for us. I wish I had a spell that I could I could snap back. Oop, there goes gravity. Are we 3-0 with this deck that didn't even look great to begin with? One, How two, did three, it not look four, good? Five, six, uh, because our first two packs were terrible, and then our third pack, we got Mana Crypt, uh, Cryptic Command, Mana Drain, and some other really good blue card. I think Jace. Those were our four first picks in pack three. And it kind of turned the think whole thing was. around. <laughs> yeah. I was like, it seems like a very good tempo deck. No, it was a, it was a pretty mediocre mono blue deck at that point. Yeah. So we can't even attack because they just give their guy pro. God, Mother of Runes is a real scumbag. Hunter, stop! Why is he so loud? I don't know. You raised him. I didn't raise him like this. Yeah, you did. <laughs> no, I didn't. Like, yeah, you did. Oh, God. He does big piggy oinks he does, right in the morning. He does do big piggy oinks. Well, everybody's trying to sleep. What do they even name here? Sure. Oh, yeah. We get McDonald's after this. We. Okay, Palancron is gone. Are we? I don't even know. Uh, nothing to do with EOT. <laughs> Got a lot of fairy boys, but no cards to play. We have two cards that interact with instants and sorceries in our graveyard, and we have no instants or sorceries in our graveyard. On the bright side, in three turns, we get to put a Jason to play, which should turn things around, theoretically. <laughs> for Jonathan, thank you so much for the bits, buddy. There's some bits freaking out at the bottom of the tip jar. I just want to dis dislodge them. <laughs> there are bits. You see them moving down here? They just keep spinning. You'll have to give more, because they didn't go away. Yeah, that's annoying. Happy Christmas and Merry New Year's, y'all. Also, I love me some Katie. You're lucky. You're cute as a button, or I'd put a hit out on you for burning that shit. No, he said I love me some ham. He didn't say he loved me. Oh, I love me some ham, Katie. Okay, I missed I missed the... Uh, also, what did the pupper get for Christmas? Oh, oh my God. Okay, let me tell you. So, 
Okay, one, the ham was inedible. I mean, Michael ate some of it, but... God, he was really doing the Lord's work And he it. tried to be really nice and encouraged me that it didn't suck, He's like, but I fine. refused to eat it, so... And we were like, we knew better. This is a lot of lands. Six, seven, eight, nine. I'm kind of wishing I left a little mog in because I have friggin' nine mana right now. Um, Watson got a holly jolly toy, which has a rope and then three little branches that are holly things and it crinkles. And he also got a fake wood chew, which nobody has chewed on thus far. Hunter got a Crinkle Kong toy, which is supposed to be quiet for indoor play because he always squeaks stuff and destroys it right when we're trying to watch TV or have a conversation or do anything. Um, sure. And he got a Benny Bone. A Benny Bone? Yeah, which he has liked. I've seen him chewing on it. I don't even know what that is. It's a twig on him. I don't know which one that is because I oh, don't I'll know show it that to you. that name does not describe. Jeez, come on! This is ridiculous. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven lands. One, two, three, four, five, six spells. Yeah, that's not a good ratio. And we're still doing fine theoretically, but it'd be nice to draw some gas. Or it something. would. Yeah. Next time we get this play, this Jace, so I'm sure we'll draw like a, a, a seventeen mana spell. I guess. Okay, that guy's gonna be. That guy's gonna be something. Can I tell what Wallace Ray got? Yeah, go for it. Okay, Wallace Ray got this little Kong toy that is a snowman that he loves. And he got a plasticky chicken ring bone, chicken flavored chicken ring, bone. ring thingy to Give chew on. It's chicken ring bone. too big for his mouth. I may have overestimated how big he was when I picked it out. Oh, what happened? Oh, two dollars by a Patreon. Wow. Justin Howard, if you're here, I appreciate it. <laughs> it's not officially a land. Okay, well, we're just going to play this stupid idiot. Play the stupid idiot. Play, play, play the stupid idiot. Come on. Oh, this is, that's, see, that's a thing right there. So we're going to put the land back. We're going to easily thirst here. Oh, no, I wore my radiology patch on. What? Oh, no. My dosimeter I wore at home. You're not supposed to wear it out of the building. We'll probably put this guy back and Mana Crypt back because we're just going to draw the Mana Crypt for the thirst. We got five, six, seven. This costs four. This costs three. But they're both instants, so we can keep them both up. Chicken patty. Chicken patty. I don't know how we're going to get out of this, though, because they have a lot of things to block. Yeah, and we yeah. have a bitter blossom that's probably going to kill us. Kill us eventually, right? Yep. You uh, could return it to your. Nope. I don't know what Brazen Borrower does. Uh, you're correct, but it's a target of non opponent permanent opponent controls. Oh, okay. Oh, they're getting aggressive I was here. like, I could read the first five words. That looked promising. Hmm. Okay. So. Hmm. One here. One here. One here. One here. One here. And... One here, I think. Sure. So now it doesn't matter which one. If you give it pro blue. Mm -hmm. um, I actually thought he was going to have like an anthem effect or something. Really? They didn't even use their mother of runes? That's interesting. So now we're just looking for a Scarab God. So one, two, three. Thalia's dead now. Uh, artifact. Mana Crypto. Brazen, Brazy B gets countered. So I don't think we want to do that. Okay. 
Well, let's keep on digging. We also have Cryptic Command here. Oh, and Mana Drain. Does High Tide do anything? Not without Palancron, I guess. Did our Palancron get exiled? It did. That's unfortunate. Hmm. Your storm count is one. <laughs> I'm gonna bottom both of these. Oh, that's interesting. Hmm. Oh, this isn't going to work the way I want it to, unfortunately. Actually, maybe it will. We can tap down their board and bounce their Mother of Runes. Yeah, that actually seems fine. Wait, but then it untaps. Was it 7, 8, 9 mana? We need 10. Wow, that's unfortunate. Oh, this is actually fine, though, because we can, we can steal the, the Student of Warfare. And still keep up Cryptic Command? That seems okay. Hmm. Okay, well, we're, we're getting somewhere. Two, three, four, five. So we have nine mana, so we can Cryptic Command, or we can Mana Drain and keep up Torrential Gear Hulk as well. God, Mother of Runes is a real pain in the ass. So they have six flyers. We have not as many flyers. Uh, let's tap all creatures and draw a card. Oh, interesting. They did not activate Mother of Runes in response, but... Wasn't it already activated? No, it was untapped. They activated oh. on our turn. But it doesn't matter. It still happens, doesn't it? Yeah, but like they could targeting. have given it pro blue or like pro black in, if, in case we did anything else. Oh, I see what you're saying. I think we're just going to manage around this. How much damage are we doing? Come on. I want, if we have time warp, we just kind of win the game, right? <laughs> He's scared of all me. Oh, <laughs> fantastic. Just going to use my... Oh, so we have Snapcaster to counter anything they might do. Yeah, this game's over. So we can actually Snapcaster, Mana Drain, and Torrential Gear, Torrential Gear Hulk, Cryptic Command. Or we can Snap Time Warp. So I'm pretty sure this game just ended. Wow, 3 0 with this sweet mono blue deck. Thank you guys so much for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Be sure to check out twitch.tv slash Frank Four. Katie Neal dot uh D D D D at Mean Mugger. I post pictures of doggies on Twitter. Okay. And uh be sure to follow or subscribe on Twitch as well, as long as uh I don't know, there's no as long as I don't know. And I also that, but... They should support me undies, even though they don't sponsor you, because they got really soft undies. Okay, well. I'm just throwing it out there. Okay, I'm going to go. Thank okay. you guys for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye!